Alright, what's going on guys, we're going to and welcome back to Moon Mission on the Technic 1.710 mod pack. Uh, we're back, so, um, since the last episode, obviously, you may notice that Emperor Palpatine is back. Good. <laughs> yep, got my skin back. Um, not sure why it uh, decided to, you know, not load the skin, but I loaded it up and it just appeared, so, sure. Um... So I've been doing a couple things off screen, um, trying to figure out this actual mod pack and how to get started on it. Um, so you may notice that the flint pickaxe now has diamond on it, it's mine level copper, uh, boosted, comfortable, pretty much that type of thing. It's, it's, it's really weird, but I'm starting to understand it. So pretty much with the pickaxes and stuff, um, with your tools, you level them up. Um, so, so say, you know, you got your, your iron pickaxes, your flint pickaxes. So, pretty much you have to create the stuff for the iron pickaxe and then put it onto your flint pickaxe. And then, yeah, it's pretty much, there's a, it's a mod. Um, what's it called? Mod. I'm going with an I. Uh, Iguana Tinker Tweaks, this mod. So what that actually allows us to do is level up our pickaxes and allows you. It pretty much it's a a way to learn Tinker's construct. You know, through by by playing, I guess I don't know, but yeah. Um, and I also made a house. Um, yeah. You guys and people make houses, me make houses in Minecraft before, there's nothing different. Um, but this is just going to be the star house and pretty much, yeah, I decided I'd just, while I was doing stuff, instead of being really tedious, because I did start it, um, but yeah, I just decided just to go ahead and just do it, get it done, not spend the next like 50,000 episodes doing a house. And I also built a... Tinkerer's Forge. Pretty much all the bricks were from the village over there uh, and then I went and made some grout and made the drains and the faucets and all of that. I actually need to uh, do that as well. Um, but yeah, I can, I can now mine copper. I can now get copper. So, what I'm going to be doing in today's episode, so I need this book. So we're going to make an alloy. So this is so that we then can actually upgrade our tools and make new tools, um, better tools, actual tools that are going to be useful. And for that, we're going to need aluminum brass made from aluminum and copper. Um, got copper. Oh, and I also uh, made a bunch of clay, clay bouquets, bouquets, um, and uh, you know, filled filled the filled the tank with lava. So I'm just gonna throw all the copper in there. I'm gonna take that seed brick back. I don't know where that went. Now throw that on top. Is there a space? There is a space. Boop. I'm gonna slowly upgrading that. Um so yeah, I'm gonna chuck all the copper in there I actually have done. Um awesome. Alright. So, you know, it's going night time. I'm gonna go down into the mine. So I can get m so yeah. Uh, also I know that the floor is grass. I want to I wanna have a cool fancy floor. I'm thinking marble or something. Is marble even in the mod pack? I'm pretty sure it is. Mm. Help if I spelt it right. It is. Alright. Yeah, I want marble as the floor. <coughs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, and I know it kind of looks a bit boring and dull. I've got the wooden floor that's going to be changed to marble soon as well. Once I get marble, I just wanted an upstairs done. I'm gonna add windows and stuff to it as well, so you know that's fine. <laughs> um, right, I'm actually gonna empty my inventory actually. Oh, and I also made a bunch of tool heads, uh, so I can actually make some tools and stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and make some fresh new tools. Um, actually, I'm gonna make some torches. So yeah, I'm pretty pretty. Familiarized with the mod pack now. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting though that. Uh, I'm actually gonna bring that book with me just to remind me of what uh, I need to get. 
uh, aluminum copper uh, and it also well I can get I don't think I can get iron yet I need to actually get that so may as well mine this copper so yeah, I'm going to start making a basement as well so this is going to be a half basement half mine shaft so should be a pretty cool base I think I like it I'll pretty much you slowly go through and upgrade your tools that's how this mod pack kind of works. Uh, that copper I'm just going to leave there for now. So I can't be bothered <laughs> messing around with all of that. I'm just going to get actually down into here. So I found a little cave. Got some copper in here. Um, I can only mine like some of this stuff. So like this stuff, tin. I need to be harvest all tin. Um, I need aluminum. Or oh, aluminium, sorry. Whichever, whichever way you want to pronounce it. Me being British, the correct way is aluminium. But I'm going to pronounce it aluminum because I don't know why. I just, I prefer it being called aluminum. Sounds better than aluminium. Um, a couple of orberry bushes, actually. These are going to be quite useful. Um, is there anything else I can grab? I can't grab iron just yet. Um... But I do have some iron tools. I may be able to smelt down, so I may actually be able to make an iron pickaxe head. That's kind of my plan. What I was thinking. Um, I need more aluminum. How much? Was it? Is, tell me, it was more copper than aluminum. Oh damn it! One copper per three aluminum. All right, this we're gonna have to find a lot of aluminum then. I don't have much down here. There's not much need all that we can get though. Uh, and I want to try and get myself a hammer soon as well. So I can just do one huge mining thing. So pretty much as I'm mining, um, if you look at the skill XP, 130 out of 289, um, pretty much as you use your pickaxe or whatever tool you're using, uh, it levels up that pickaxe and it gains a random modifier each time you use it. So, it's pretty cool, I like it, it's different, um, but it makes making a brand new pickaxe, yeah it is bad making a brand new pickaxe, because then you have to restart and do all the level ups again, but also it's also good because you can get different modifiers on your pickaxe and stuff, so, yeah, I'm not, I don't know, just, uh, oh, aluminum all berry bush, alright, perfect, that's actually going to be really useful. For growing aluminum. Perfect. So, how much have we got now? We should have a decent amount. Uh, 10. Alright. Probably need a bit more than that, but that might just do us for making um, our pickaxe upgrade. See, and another one of these holes that goes right down to the, uh, to the bedrock. Oh, we're actually going to have to grab this. Wait, if I put a torch here, is this going to just get rid of the source block? Apparently so. Alright, where's this aluminum? Oh. There we go. Boom. Alright, then we can mine this now. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. I don't know why some takes longer than others to mine. I don't know, it kind of feels like that. Boom. There we go. Uh, I'm actually going to put a torch down there. Um, how far have we leveled this up? I might try and level this up in this episode as well. Is anything close? Alright. Is, is this close? No. Nope. Obviously, the pickaxe is probably the easiest thing to level up. Um, just show you guys that whole leveling up thing. Cause it's, it's pretty cool how it works. It just chucks a random modifier on, and then that's how it works. I'm gonna actually, because when you mine an ore, you get um, I think two, two XP per. So this is on 177 right now. Um, I'm actually gonna have to find something I can actually mine. Yeah, two, it's on 
177. Mine one block. 179. So this should put it to 180 with the piece cobble. Yeah. So ores take two. Might level up by two. And cobble is by one. It's pretty cool. There we go. I'm learning. I'm getting though that I like it. It's a uh, very in-depth, like you know, leveling system for you know pretty much learning how to use Tinker's construct, which is actually perfect for me. Because um, I'm actually going to get some coal because I don't really have much. Because um, I know how to use it, but not like super advanced, like know how to use it. There we go. And found some aluminum as well, which is perfect. All right, so um, let's dig all this out. I may as well dig out this copper as well. See if we can get a level up, or close to a level up. There you go. So uh, yeah, I'll pretty much will be doing some live streams of this series as well. So like mining or you know whenever I'm doing something cool building or something, just something like really grindy that I'll probably just do off screen. I may just stream that. So uh, keep an eye out for those. Um, should be pretty fun. Because I'll be pretty much trying to, you know, I can just like chill out, just mine or something for a bit. If I need to get like some, you know, some bulk load of items for the next episodes next couple episodes, uh, I can just stream it and then just, you know, do it with you guys. Mine it out. Pretty fun. It's seriously still night time, is it? Just, oh no, it's coming daytime. Is it going night time? I think the sun is rising. Not sure. Alright, so we've got 44 copper in there. So I'm going to throw all the aluminum in there. Actually going <coughs> to... Can I just place these anywhere? So I can. Just can place. Alright, I can't place them anywhere. What about over here in this hole? Can I place them in here? I can place them in here. Alright. <laughs> We've got a little aluminum farm and a copper farm. Sure, why not? We'll just leave them in there. When they grow, they'll grow. So. Throw that in there. Alright, so we've got aluminum brass. Perfect. So, what we now need to do, so now we've got aluminum brass, we need to grab a pickaxe head. Now, uh, the rest I'll, I'll leave for time because we're upgrading our pickaxe at the moment. Uh, and then we need to go ahead and place that on there. So, I want to make sure aluminum brass is at the bottom. And let's just throw the rest of this copper in there. And then boom, make a pickaxe head mold. Perfect. Did I actually use the pickaxe? I used the pickaxe head. Alright, that's fine. I'm not bothered. I don't want it anyway. Um, then I should, because it takes one. Oh, it's one material. Alright, so I'm thinking I may be able to like melt down all these like iron like parts that are in here. I really hope I can. That'd be amazing because I can't actually mine iron right now. I can. Oh yes, that's perfect. Not not the steak. That's mine. <laughs> Alright, that's perfect. So I can actually melt all that down. So I want to pour out a copper head. So boom. So we've got ourselves a copper pickaxe head. So I think what I want to do now is actually upgrade this current pickaxe to copper. Which I think I need to repair it first. In order to do so. So do that. Repair it. That's not quite repaired it. Can I use can't use that to repair it either. I need more goddamn gravel. I have to find some gravel. Damn it. Should have some. 
Oh, there was some gravel somewhere. I remember. I remember seeing it. Is this another one that goes right down? It is. I don't know whether I don't know what that is, but that like why it does that, but it's really annoying. <laughs> I need gravel. I need the gravel. Where is some gravel? Should be some by this beach right here, right? Oh, wait, there's some down in the mine, isn't there? I'm gonna go grab it. Come on. Down to the hole. And uh, there's no gravel here, is there? No. Alright, in, in we go. Alright. Um, so, yeah, I need to fix this pickaxe. And then we can upgrade it to a copperhead pickaxe. And then, once it's a copperhead pickaxe, we can then probably mine tin. Or possibly iron, because we've got upgrades on it already. Oh, there's actually there's more cave here. Way more cave. Alright, cool. That just goes to coal. That's fine. Alright, so let's go back up top. Um, so pretty much, it's like a whole progression system. Is that marble? Is that no? That's limestone. There's like a whole progression system for your tools, um, and you pretty much upgrade every single part. You just have to make sure your thing is repaired. Um, so when you get into the more expensive stuff, it is harder to upgrade, but easier because you can just go ahead and collect it. So it it works out in a way. So boom, flint. Last time I'll ever have to repair that pickaxe with flint. Then boom, there we go. So it is now a copperhead. So six two one six four four. I didn't really upgrade it much, but it upgrades it. So you know, can't complain. Uh, mining XP. Oh, it is actually really close to leveling up. So if we throw all this stuff back in here first. So we go out here real quick. So we should have iron there. Alright, so if we make a iron one, uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and make uh, some some casts real quick. Boom, aluminum brass. So then that make an ingot cast. Perfect. So I can now like pipe out stuff as and when I need it. So copper. We'll just grab a block of this for now. Um join that 89. We'll grab a lot of this. There we go. Got a block of copper. So we need to mine only a couple blocks, you know. That's not too bad. Alright, so we'll grab those for repairing our uh, copper pickaxe. And we'll head back down. So, mining level copper. So I can actually mine nothing new. The last one. Alright, uh, we'll head back in. We'll uh, mine all this coal down here. So. Not far off leveling up, if I'm looking at the right thing anyway. Um, yeah, mining XP. Not many blocks. So I'm going to he head here and we'll mine up this. So is that? Yeah, that is the right thing. So only a couple blocks. There's probably this, all this coal down here. Should be enough. Boom. Alright, we'll mine this coal. Boom. So there we go. It leveled up. One mining level increased. So now we can mine iron. So everything up to iron we are able to mine with this pickaxe. So um skill XP. So I think that so yeah we can actually mine iron now. That is actually so cool. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's that. That's how the hell we do that stuff. Iguana tweaks. It's different. But fun, I guess. Alright, so we'll head now, we'll head back up top. And. So, boom. Head back up. 
So now we can use the copper that we just got to upgrade our pickaxe to an iron pickaxe and then we can mine everything up to iron and then we can upgrade it and I think it'll go to redstone I think I think that's how that works so if I go to tool station and actually turn these into ingots tool station put a copper bar down per you iron pickaxe head so now we have an iron pickaxe. Bam. So now it has. Why wow, is this really close to leveling up again? Alright, awesome. Uh, what's your ability at it? Or am I just. Oh, wait, wait, it has to be in there, doesn't it? It's a poke job. So it's got 700 durability now. So durability's not going up crazy amounts, but it's, it's still going up. I think that might be the binding. So I think if I can put a slime binding on it. So. don't think that's actually going to change it at all. What about the normal slime binding? Is that going to change it at all? No. Never mind then. Alright, so I think now Molten Aluminum Alright, you can't make tools out of aluminum brass. Alright, well what we're gonna do, let's empty all that into there again. Should probably have these smelling. Cause we get double the ore from those. So I can now mine pretty much everything in the uh, in the cave. So we'll go ahead, we'll go back down once more. <laughs> and we'll see what we get from getting this pickaxe leveled up because um, I don't know what I need to get next after iron so I'm pretty sure this will go to redstone, so what's this? I can't actually, I can't actually mine tin yet, so it'll go to tin next then will it? alright, so maybe it'll go to tin next alright, well I'm going to have to mine iron there we go so it's actually not far from leveling up, so if we keep mining like coal or iron or something, then I believe we should be able to level it up. There we go, boom! Increased mining level. Now we can mine tin. Awesome. And I'm not sure what we do from there, so I'm gonna have to look up that for next episode. But um yes, it's been sort of a like a little uh guide for you guys if you're playing um the Technic 1.710 mod pack then that's how you get started in iguana tools so um let's head back up top let's put all these ores into the smeltery and we'll go over what we're going to do in the next episode so next episode i'll probably have a bunch of tools well, yeah, I'll probably have a bunch of tools built up, um, a bunch of iron tools ready for next episode. So I'll level up all my tools for next episode. Uh, so the flint shovel, the bone stabber, the flint hatchet, we'll have all those made of iron. Uh, I'll make an iron hammer as well. I'll have all that ready for next episode. Um, we'll probably build the hammer in next episode, to be honest. So I think, from looking at this book, I think... We want to make this, but we need obsidian. Or maybe bronze. Let's have a look. So, what's this book we want to look at? So we know what we need to look for for next episode to make... Alright, so... Wood, stone, iron... Copper... Ardite... Like stone, stone, paper, cobalt, iron, bronze, redstone. So our next level up is, is bronze. So that's what we want to be looking for. Um. All right. So bronze. How do we make bronze? I should be able to make it as tin and stuff in it. Copper and tin. So yeah. 
So for next episode, I'll have like I'll probably upgrade my tools to tin, and have them all bronze and stuff. And I'll have them all like bronzed out and all of that. So um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. This is a huge learning experience. You've not actually done anything towards the mod pack because it's so focused on these tools at the moment. At the moment, but I'm trying to get a floor in. So if next episode we have the hammer and everything, then I think we'll hollow out the basement. I may even do that off screen. Um, and we'll go looking for marble and other useful materials and stuff. So yeah, um, hope you guys have enjoyed. Thanks for watching. If you did find this video at all useful with the iguana, if iguana tweaks, then a like would be greatly appreciated. If you do go and enjoy the series, also drop a like as well. And if you are new, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, I've been going for more daily Minecraft or buy daily Minecraft. This week is going to be purely daily Minecraft because I've been—I don't know why—I've really been enjoying setting and playing it for some reason. It's been really weird. I've just been playing it and playing it, so it's just going to be Minecraft all this week and probably most of next week as well. So enjoy that. Um, and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.